Hola YouTube, my name is Ricardo Lino and I'm a will addict. Let me just go outside. You got it. I'm in San Diego, California, right by the beach. Let me show you what I am. And I'm about to skate quite a, a long distance, I think. Let me show you. I want to go to downtown San Diego and have about 11 miles to do. But first, let me show you the beach. Wow, like a known surf spot here, huh? here on the way to downtown it's quite there I don't know if you can really see it that's Coronado Island so I need to skate through Coronado Island all the way to the ferry to then hit the ferry and go to downtown San Diego it's been a while since the last time I was there so let's get it I'm right, right next to the to the Mexican border, really close to Tijuana. So Mexican food here, it's a thing. So I'm gonna try to find one of those breakfast burritos or California burritos or something. I really need one of those in my life right now. Good, and I'm still on wheels. And I haven't done more than a half a mile, so let me see where I am. Wind is not the best, huh? Getting with the wind? is the worst. I never actually skated any distance in California. I always go everywhere by car. And I guess that's like a common thing. Do I go on 7th Street? Maybe, I'm kind of lost. So, this seems like it's a bike path. And now, it's quite like a big distance. Let me show where I'm going. This is the bike lane that I've been trying to find. Got a bit lost, and I'm here. So now, it's all about skating. Three minutes away if I was on a bicycle. 8.7 miles to go. Now the time to get rid of this. After all, it's California, right? Keep going. So we keep going. The hatch is off to get a little bit of color, and it seems like we made it to Coronado Island. So there's about five and a half miles to go. 
getting there. Ooh. So, 2.7 miles to go. We're getting this. It's hot and it's windy against me. But it's actually cool. Feeling fresh. Okay, so I'm about to get to the civilization, Coronado Island. Oh, that was actually a, a wax ledge there. And I just reminded, there's like one of my first pictures on Daily Bread was a, a macchio with, with the other foot, like a freestyle macchio with the other foot just hovering over a spike fence. And that's here. It would be really cool while I'm skating that I would see the spot. If I see it, I'll show it to you guys for sure. Now, let's see. Probably I'm getting tired. Too tired that I can't even see any of that shit. The marina. I'm actually going faster than bikes, which is cool. Uh, some bike tours. It would actually be really cool if there would be people doing skate tours. Never thought of that, that could be a business right there. Let me see if I'm going in the right direction now. <laughs> this thing is now making me go uphill. I hope there's a downhill after. Okay, so this might be the downhill that I wanted. It's nothing, but it's better than nothing. That's cool. Felt good. All the way straight to the ferry. Then across the ferry, and on the other side, downtown Sydney. Check this, urban slalom. Now, let's see. I'm about to get to the ferry. I think it's around here. But I don't really think they're gonna allow me to go on the ferry with skates. I know they're super strict to that here in the US. So let's see. Maybe I can try to make my friendly face. <laughs> And on the other side, you got downtown San Diego. Got the ticket. Seems like I'm in. There too, to the skates. I don't mind. <sighs> That's guy looking at me. By Coronado Island. It's been real. Right here, so 
You've seen Carlos doing something here. Get to grind right here. Let me show you something different. Now I'm gonna show you that you probably never saw. And that is, I'll show you in a second. Out in the wild, trying to show you one of the biggest <laughs> tricks ever done. See the ledge? See the gap? Yeah. This thing has been done. Matthew Weinman, Backside Royale. Let me show you from the top how sketchy this thing is. But it's like, I don't know if you can see it. Over there where you jump, it feels like if the ledge goes like on my armpit because it would come up. Then I just check the gap. Wow. <laughs> this is pure madness. Well, I have a wonderful electronic invention I want you to see. It, it looks something like this. So crazy. Let's get to downtown. I think I remember downtown San Diego with a lot more people. Crazy. The spots are all kept. Even the little war rides or whatever. Everything is just kept. So weird. Okay, so I'm probably gonna get kicked out of here in no time. But there is a spot here that I want to see again. There's a spot here that I've tried to backside the kink and I never really landed it. We tried to shoot some pictures. Yes, that's one. That little, that kink ledge right there. I tried to backside it for Jelly Bread, but it never really happened. We had two photographers, we have two guys filming. I never really landed it. Would have been a cool thing, check. I really think I never really landed because it was a little bit like this. It's actually high. That's the spot. The type of spots that I used to look for. I know there's some rails in the corner. This is all desert. This used to be full of shops pumping. <laughs> it's weird. I'll show you on the shop of this shopping mall. There's a rail that Carlo Pianowski did. Before that, there's also some rails around here. But I want to show you the spot from Carlos. Carlos killed San Diego. Is it true? Look at this, there's nothing here. Skating around a desert shopping mall. Some of the rails that I was thinking. This is so weird. There's no one here. It's right here on the top. I don't know exactly how to get there. I don't even know how to get there. I might even be able to bomb this thing down. <laughs> oh no, they don't even let you go there anymore. I need to find a way to get to the top floor. Okay, it's closed. I would love to show you something, but I can't I'll try to show you here from the side. So basically here, there's the king rail that comes right from the top. It's just huge, it's hard to explain. Carlos Pinoski did it. Now, little hill bomb. Let's get it. you guys enjoyed this video I'm gonna keep discovering a little bit more kind of like reminding some of the spots that I used to skate or 
people that I used to skate with. And that's it. If you want to see more of these, you know what to do. Subscribe to the channel. Give me a thumbs up if you like this one. Thumbs down if you didn't like it. Let me know what you didn't like about this video. And like I always say, just don't forget why we all started skating. That is because it's fun. By the way, just check this box. Let me just finish this video. I just met the Adapt Pro team. Hi. <laughs> Hi, these are my skates. Hi, Mom. I'm pro for adapt. <laughs> okay. I, I'm not. I'm nothing for adapt, but I got their frame. So. <laughs> You're a good friend. Yeah, man. <laughs> I like this. Some Europeans getting like some drinks in in, in stupid America, but yeah, it's fun. <laughs> uh, you know, we don't say the word stupid. <laughs> don't say stupid. About five hours later, I'm back at it. I just met you at that pro team, we've been skating around downtown and now, well now I'm gonna do it all over again so what I want you guys to take from this video is you really wanna do your stuff, just do it, skate there <laughs> <laughs>